friends hope you all are doing well and staying safe welcome back to yet another video of the football mania to bring you all the latest news and exciting updates from the world of football be excited be hopeful and be the man or the woman to support indian football right now because officially the kick off the dream campaign is going to be launched and finally we are going to see the young blue tigresses of team india in the under 17 level kick off the fifa under 17 women's world cup they will be facing off against a very strong usa team which have been very competitive in previous outings and they have a fully fit squad and going into this match head coach thomas denerby of the indian team was you know quite optimistic that india can make it to the knockout stages but given the fact that they are playing against teams like USA, Morocco and Brazil, this will be a very, very stern test of their talent. And obviously, this is a very young squad. I haven't heard many names in the past. But, you know, if you look at this squad, they have, you know, that kind of energy, that kind of enthusiasm while playing football. And as I've said in so many of my videos previously, the FIFA World Cup, hosted for the second time in India is going to you know create a very very big revolution and for these young girls to get an opportunity at this massive stage they have to grab it with both hands because not everyone from India is quite lucky in terms of having or witnessing the World Cup and definitely these girls have proven their talent in previous tournaments as well if you look at you know the kind of competitive environment where young girls are playing in India right now. You know, looking at the way the FIFA Women's World Cup is flourishing previously and how women's football is being given the priority in many football ecosystems, I have no doubt that these young blue tigresses will make India proud. And definitely, if you look at even, you know, Thomas Denerby as a coach, he brings in a wealth of experience when it comes to playing some pragmatic, proactive football. And you know, a lot of pundits are talking about how India can set up in a big block and you know use the width of the pitch, play more expansive football through the middle third, and ensure that they are you know bringing their wingers into play. And you know it will be all about how India can tackle the attacking prowess of USA because you know both the strike partners for USA have scored eight goals each at the under 17 level and that just goes to show that you know we are coming up against a very very tough opponent if we talk about you know having a good start to the match i will be hopeful that you know we can you know create some patterns of play ensure that the build up is good and don't lose possession of the ball simply because you know whenever you give strong teams any a sniffle of a chance they will be there to capitalize and we have seen this USA team you know flourishing under their coach there have not been many teams if I have talked about in the past who have you know really challenged the almighty Brazil for example but if you look at this USA team even their senior national team has been doing well recently and it all goes down to the philosophy of that nation how they want to bring up players and how they want to you know, create a roster of talent coming through the ranks. And the same goes for India because we haven't heard of these girls in the past. Yes, they must be playing brilliantly at the, you know, their local level. There have been a lot of occasions where we have seen that, you know, these girls have taken the limelight and absolutely I have no doubt in my mind once again that, you know, all the players will be buzzing with energy. They'll be pumped up. And everyone knows for a fact that, you know, India has never consecutively hosted two World Cups. And obviously, you know, COVID was there in 2020 and India could not host it. But finally, putting aside all the litigations which were in place against AIFF, I think this is going to be a start of a revolution. Whatever may be the result, these will be moments for these young girls to cherish for the rest of their life and they need to make the most of this opportunity because you know it's all about grabbing the moment and i'm sure these young girls would never disappoint they have got this opportunity rightly so 
you know it is all based on merit finally and if you are there in the team you have to you know just deliver you have to give your 100% and i think thomas denerby's message to these young girls will be quite simple just go out there and express yourselves and ensure that you are enjoying football you know you don't need to have that mental block or pressure knowing the fact that this is a global tournament you just need to play you know free football ensure that you know and you are enjoying the game and that is what matters and when you do that the result will automatically come in your favor you know tactics can be set out on drawing boards you can have a coach who is trying to emphasize on certain things during the game but what matters is the players are able to decide for themselves and if you look at this indian team i have some hope that you know they can at least frustrate usa ensure that they are not allowing usa to dominate the possession because when that happens india can suffer hopefully that is not the case hopefully these girls can pull off a very big surprise against the usa and let's hope that team india performs well so guys the kick off dream campaign is finally going to be activated today when india face usa at the kalinga stadium at 8 pm indian time so please stay tuned and we'll be reviewing all of india's matches in you know subsequent videos so if you like this video please do not forget to hit the like button and if you have not yet subscribed to the football mania it is very simple please do me a favor hit the bell notification and hit the subscribe button for regular updates so until next time stay safe and take care